Alright, thank you very much. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Hello, I'm Elma from Offering C. Thank you very much for the opportunity uh, that has been given so I can discuss about something interesting today. So without any further, since we don't have any time to talk more, uh, let me start my speech by asking you a question. So you all must have social media, right? Okay, let's say you all have it. And my next question will be, how do you use it? What do you share through your social media account? Is it something related to your lives update, your traveling journey, or maybe you only repost your friend's Insta story? However, this time we will not talk about that. I want you to look social media from another perspective. You should know another fact that social media, which you use to entertain yourself, can be an appropriate platform to educate someone. However, if you have known this, then let me continue. How? How SOSMED can support education? How SOSMED can educate someone? How SOSMED can uh, share knowledge? And how we can join in the movement? But first, let me explain what social media is. According to investopedia.com, social media is a technology that facilitates its users to share thoughts, information, even photos and videos through virtual networks and communities. There are different types of social me media networks. As you can imagine, Instagram, Facebook, WhatsApp, Brainly, Quora, Snapchat, YouTube are included. I believe that you are familiar with this named. Based on the data from backlinko.com, social media, which has been popularized since 1996, passes 4.48 billion users in July 2021. Yes, that's so many, and it shows you the power of social media. The users are now re not restricted by age, because from kids to adult, even the elderly people uh, use it to communicate or update news. It was dominated by uh, users with age range 18 to 29 years old. From those facts, considering the age of the users, I believe that they need a good content which is not only entertain them, but also give benefits, especially in the terms of education. One of interesting things that I found yesterday is many people from different backgrounds try to give a good impact using their social media. They educate people and gain much followers who indirectly encourage them to always post an informative content. Let's take an example. You must know a well-known figure such as Jerome Pauline, Gita Safitri, or maybe Raditya Dika. Gita Safitri, yes, she is a YouTuber who mostly shares uh, her thoughts about socio social issues and education. Her purpose to make a YouTube is so inspiring. She said that she wants to make a good content because she realizes that not many YouTubers did that on that time. One of her contents about insecurity uh, shares what she knows about, sh about insecurity with some reliable sources. It makes her viewers know more about the topic and it can influence the viewers to respond in security itself. So there are uh, 651 comments there, and I know not all of them agree with her, but at least by making a video, Gita Safitri provide a place to learn together. Despite the, the, the disagreement, at the end of the day, her purpose is to educate, to make change, to learn together, to share something good by utilizing social media. And that's what we will discuss next. So how, how we can join her? Yes, I myself haven't started yet, but I want to make a movement together with you by sharing this tip. So the first one that we need to do is share what you know, share what you know. I believe that something we know is usually considered interesting for us. So share something good, with others and make change together. For example, you love reading books. It won't change you 
if you read it yourself. It won't change the world if you read it yourself, but it will have impact when you share your experience on social media, uh, share your summary, or maybe you include your favorite quotes from the book. Uh, what do you think people will respond to it? I know people will be curious, right? Yes, that's the first step, making people curious. Second, share an informative news through your account. By doing this, you will let people know and you can share something useful with them. All in all, the key is sharing. And the last one, encouraging people to follow your steps. How? There are many ways. Through an attractive uh, caption, a persuasive way to talk, uh, a good presentation, or ask them directly. Social media will help you, will facilitate you to get more people to learn or do the same thing, the good thing, even it can reach people from around the world. Ladies and gentlemen, becoming the first one to make a change, especially utilizing social media in the terms of education is not easy at all. However, we will not know if we don't try. So from the explanation, we know that we can contribute in improving the knowledge of many people by only posting a good thing on social media. Therefore, be wise. That's all from me. Thank you for your attention. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Waalaikumsalam warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Thank you, Emma, for the speech. Uh, maybe there is a question from you guys who want to ask Emma about the speech that has been delivered. Maybe. I think there is no question. Maybe Elma want to uh, say explanation or give summary for the speech. Okay. Thank you. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.